if anything, I criticize myself rather than crit criticize other people. Yeah. Um, and you know, always try my best. We're always doing our best. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Given whatever, whatever it is we've got to, whatever operating system we've got going on at the time. Yeah, yeah. yeah? And you're not choosing that. <laughs> Do you understand? Mm -hmm. You're not mm -hmm. choosing it. Yeah. <clears throat> if we could, it'd be blissful in there all the time. It would be for me. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? And I'm not a masochist by nature. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm, I'm not purposely out to try and hurt myself. You know? Mm -hmm. Just kind of comes up, but we forget or we don't realize that this stuff just comes up and, and then we personalize it when it does come up and then we get critical of ourself because it does come up because we take ownership of it and responsibility for it and we believe it's me that's doing it. <laughs> it's fucking not. <laughs> mm. Mm. Like it's not, yeah? Mm. And you've seen that. I know you've seen that. You know, because, stuff just arises. It just kind of happens. Thoughts just flow through and feelings yeah. feelings just pop up at random. Anytime they bloody feel like popping up, yeah? When you, when you stop personalising that stuff and realise you're not doing that, it just happens. Mm. So you are totally, absolutely not responsible for it, yeah? There are some that there are some that would say, "Okay, yeah, I might not be responsible for it, but I'm responsible how I act and react to that." There are some that would say that, yeah, mm -hmm. but that again, that's only if the thought also pops up. I'm responsible for how I act and react to that. Mm. If that doesn't pop up, then you're just going to act and react however you're going to act and react in that moment, yeah. Yeah, well, I did contemplate the point of from last time with yep. the the sounds and the labeling. Beautiful. Um, like often, I do still wake at four in the morning for whatever reason. So and do I. Because there's less, <laughs> yeah. because there's less distractions. The yeah. the thoughts are louder. Yeah. And so I sort of contemplated the the change in language thing. Yep. And there was this very strong image in my head of me trying to say something that couldn't be understood. And um, an assumption yep. that, that this, this image was producing the thoughts which needed to um, have a conversation with the other thoughts. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> The, the the irony is that's all that's ever happening. Mm. So when you said to stay with the sounds, you mean just leave them as blah, 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 blah? That's all it is. <laughs> before, you lab yeah, before you label it, yes. I'm serious. Mm. The stuff that floats through our head in relation to me yeah. is absolute rubbish I mean that absolute rubbish it does not deserve a second glance because none of it's true and I mean none of it no matter how much you're going to try and you, you, you will try and convince yourself that oh no yeah but some of it's true <laughs> no None of it is true. I don't care what it is, what it, whatever it is that floats through in relation to a me or in relation to the personalised self, not one scary, I don't care what it says. I don't care what it says. Even if it's saying you're a terrific bloke, mm -hmm. it's not true. If it's saying you're, a, you're, you're an arsehole, it's mm -hmm. not true. No matter what it says, None of it is true. Zero, zip, nada. And it's just noise. <laughs> it's 
<laughs> you know, like I said to you last time we, we, we spoke, it might as well be in another language. And if it mm -hmm. was in another language that you didn't understand, what effect would it have on you? Zip, nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. well, sometimes help me go back to sleep. Like I change, change the language or do the yeah. amnesia thing. Yeah. And then what's sort of subside and I go back to sleep. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, like don't fight it. Ignore yeah. it. Ignore mm. it. Shift the attention. Right. Don't fight it. You never fight it and you never try and stop it. Mm. Yeah? Because the idea of fighting it or stopping it is just another thought that comes up to fight it and another thought comes up to stop it and thought is the problem it's like thoughts trying to get rid of thoughts <laughs> mm. it's not possible mm. yeah mm. it's literally yeah, it's possible. Not, yeah. it's possible. not possible yeah or it's yeah. like the ego trying to kill the ego <laughs> yeah. you know yeah. um, um what did I say in group the other day? I cracked a joke. Uh, I said, um, oh, that's right, yeah. Um, I'm more than prepared, absolutely more than prepared to give up the ego, yeah? Now, what's in it for me? <laughs> <laughs> and that's how the ego works. Yeah. Well, that's how that, that, and when I say ego, I'm just talking about thoughts. There's not a separate ego. There's not, yeah? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The word, the word e ego, uh, I think, was it Freud? Freud, yeah. I think it was Freud that even invented it, you know what I mean? Yeah. Then it's kind of stuck around. Prior to that, there was no idea of an ego, <laughs> yeah? But the, the problem is that was invented, and then people saw it as an appendage. Mm. I've got to get rid of the ego. Yeah, I've got I've I've got to um, uh, humble the ego. The ego's got to be and all this shit. It's <laughs> it's crazy shit. It's really quite but the, crazy. the ego would never go. Ego. The ego would never go. But you just don't don't. No 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 no. Ego goes. Let's rephrase that mm. and let me ask you the question. Yeah. Does me ever go? Mm, yes. Well, me goes when I'm asleep. Yeah. But, but can the me ever go when you're awake? Mm -hmm. Yeah, when you're not thinking. You mm. don't have any thoughts. Ah, is there an ego when there's no thoughts? No. Is there a me when there's no thoughts? No. No. Okay. So, so, and this is the very point that I was just making. People think the ego is an appendage. Mm -hmm. Okay. And it's not. I affectionately call the ego and the me, mm. me ego. Miko. Mm -hmm. It's the same thing. Mm -hmm. They're mm -hmm. not two. Mm -hmm. They are not two. Right? So the, the, the whole idea of being on the non dual path, mm -hmm. the non duality path, is seeing and the recognition there is no me. There's not one there. While you're awake, mm -hmm. that, that realisation happens. Yeah. And when that's fully seen, fully seen, yeah, and mm -hmm. it just naturally drops, ego and me is gone. However, that can scare some people because they go, how will I operate? Who will I be? How will I function? How will I do this? And, and, and so on and so forth. So um, let me uh, uh, just appease that, if that may be a thought that, that comes up for you, yeah? Your personality, no. the personality still remains. Mm. See, this, my body, 
has um, uh, what's the word? Can't think of it. Um, natural gestures. I do things. With, I talk with my hands like crazy, and I I can't stop it. That's just what it's doing. Yeah. Yeah. And then you'll have somebody else that's awake, and they won't do that. Mm. Yeah. So yeah. this is just part of the way this particular apparatus functions, including mm. Mm. including its sense of humour. Yeah, its playfulness, its uh, the timbre of the voice. <laughs> so there's a the point I'm trying to make here is there's a huge difference between uh, the personality and I, and I've done it I've got to think of another way or another word even because we put personality which makes it sound like there's still a person and there's not mm -hmm. but for the moment I'm just calling it personality uh, um, and, but what I mean by that is there's still just there's still you're still unique yeah 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 yeah, you still remain unique. It's just the personalizing stops altogether. That's what that's what that's referred to as awakening. That's what you're after. Otherwise, mm. we wouldn't be having this conversation. Yeah. So drop the very idea that ego is always going to be there. <laughs> Or drop the very idea that me is always going to be there. I'm very happy to drop that. Oh, please do, because that, that that'll you'll be hamstrung to that if you don't. Mm. And, and I'm and I'm saying that because it's not true. Me does go. Yeah. Or yeah. I could say ego does go. They're one and the same thing. They're not two. Mm. They're not two. It's the it's the same, it's one and the same thing. That's why I call it the Mego. Yeah. Yeah, same as the person. Yeah. The identification of the, with the person, yeah. 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 And, and, you know, how does one disidentify with the, you know, or, or how does the disidentification with the person happen? In the truth of seeing what that actually really is the truth the truth will set you free 